Sometimes you have to use touch-up paint around this, like you've got a couple of little scuffs here that you're not going to see on the camera probably, uh, but it's worthwhile just going in. And okay. if you have the touch-up paint to hit these kind of things, because the less you give them to look at and distract them from seeing the big beautiful picture, the better off you're going to be. Now, if you're going to do the paint yourself, there's some tricks. You can take a wet brush and a dry brush, water down the paint a little bit so it goes on real thin. Okay. Right? And you can just dab it on with a wet brush and then you can whisk back across it with a dry brush. It'll blend and it. it'll blend it right in so oh, you okay. won't get these patches where it looks like you've just dabbed on painting because the paint will also, um, uh, as it's drying, the colors will change and as it ages, the colors change. So to get it to blend in as well as you can, hit it with a magic eraser if that doesn't come off and just do that wet brush, dry brush thing. Okay. Okay? Mm -hmm.